We all love Connie Britton in Nashville, and now she's starring with Jason Bateman, Tina Fey, a whole star set of cast. And this is where I leave you playing a smart and successful shrink who falls for their lovable loser of a brother. Take a look. You okay there? Yeah. I realize what this must look like to you all. I mean, this is supposed to be a fling, you know, younger guy. Get in, get out, move on. Appropriate men are so boring, you know? I do know. It wasn't supposed to turn into anything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, really, look at him. He's a moron. Yeah. Of course, I'm the moron who fell in love with him. And Connie Britton joins us now. <laughs> you, know, you know, the minute your character walks into this family, a very kind of dysfunctional family, you know she's too good for Philip and she can't help herself. I know, I know. But I love the character because, um, you know, I really love to play strong women, but, but strong women with flaws and with things that they're dealing with in their life. And I like this character because she is very successful, very accomplished. And she's got it together. She's totally got it together. But her tragic flaw is she falls for these guys, you know, and we get to see her discover that in this movie. And, you know, it's not, this is an ensemble movie and it's not a huge part of the movie, and yet we still get to see that journey for her. No, and, 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 and she lets you see everyone else in the family as well because she's the outsider yeah. coming in. And, of course, you play across Adam Driver, yeah. who plays Philip. Well, he Such just, an incredible he, actor. Yeah, he just grabs the screen. He really does. He is just, he's, he's a huge star and he's going to be a gigantic star. And it's you really tell incredible. the minute you saw him on Girls, yeah. he had something real, and he shows even more of it. Well, he's right really here. just such an authentically talented actor. I mean, he's really a joy to work with, but everyone in this cast was a joy to work oh, with. You know, where to, where to begin? Tina Fey, uh, Jason Bateman, Jane Fonda. The Fire. best ever. The best ever. I, I, it was just my joy and my honor to be able to work on this movie. And you got the chance to bond with Jane a little bit? Yes! She's really so incredible and inspiring, and I have to say, I, I do find myself some mornings or whenever I'm having a moment of what, what should I do with this particular situation? I, I think, what would Jane do? Because <laughs> she's been doing a lot of things right for a long time. You know, whatever controversies have been, but she is beautifully um, contained and strong, and she's done a she lot. She looks great in the movie. Also, she plays a really compelling character. Yeah, she's a wonderful human being. We have to talk about Nashville, third season. Yeah! yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you left everyone hanging. Raina left everyone hanging. Yes, at the end we of did. Season. Yeah, we did. That's what we do. And a, a tiny little bit of a hint on who she's going to choose. Please. <laughs> Help me out Robin. here, Robin. <laughs> no. I, why would I do that? I wouldn't want to ruin it for you. It's going to be so fun. It is. It's going to be a fun season. It's going to be fun. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. And, you know, Raina's going to make a decision. Will it be the right decision? I don't know. We'll see. So a decision, though, does that mean she chooses one of them or walks away? We don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing my best, Rob. I'm trying everything that. Well, we cannot wait. It's coming up in just a couple weeks. Connie Britton, thanks very much. Thank you. This is where I leave you is in theaters Friday, September 19th. That's coming right up as well, and we'll be right back.